all around us there's just hustle bustle noise there is rickshaws there is bikes there is cars how people are knocked down i don't know this is my first uh, stop before my journey uh, into uh, Luca tomorrow morning where we're traveling and that is where we're going to start our track what a wonderful baptism of fire certainly today and on our journey here and um, perhaps this is the pinnacle of the journey I have spent over nine days uh, trekking. Um, trying to paint with pastels and I can't keep my uh, gloves on for long or keep my gloves off for long because they, uh, they stop working. I've lost the feeling in my fingers now and when I put the pastel to the board the pastel breaks because I don't know what pressure I'm putting on so I'm trying to put the I'm trying to put the pastel on without putting too much pressure and I can hardly hold the pastel okay for the last time I'm going to take off my gloves and try and just do the small little bit at the bottom but I think that's as much as I'm going to be able to do on this painting The whole experience um, was originally very simple. I had one goal, and that was to travel um, to um, the Himalayas and to paint uh, at altitude at uh, 18,000 feet. Did I achieve the goal? Yes. Um, I think perhaps this whole experience has been much more than just uh, reaching the goal. Was it extreme art? Yes it was. But for me, um, immersing myself into what I um, have seen as the most beautiful, wonderful uh, landscape and immersing myself in the culture of the Sherpa people, um, I have grown to perhaps understand a little bit more about the values of life and for me I'm returning to my studio in Ireland with uh, a renewed sense of urgency to paint more of what I feel as opposed to what I have seen. Um, the journey um, was exciting, perhaps one of the most exciting trips that I have taken and certainly for me uh, the journey is not over.